Yo, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video of Portland Small Franchise. We are here in Week 12, coming off a Week 11 big-time victory against the Patriots, one of our division rivals, I believe? Yeah, they definitely are a division rival because we are in the AFC, what, East? Yeah, AFC East. Um, we are going to face the Browns, who are also 5-5, five and five. another AFC matchup. Last week, we did have a Player of the Week in uh, Darius Bowen, you had five tackles, hard tackle for loss somewhere in there. Uh, Into from recovery, and I think one of the, in, well, I think the Into was a pick six, or maybe the from recovery was a from recovery touchdown. We're playing well, we're stringing uh, together a few wins, we're five and five. Um, might be able to get in the playoffs. We're going to upgrade some players. I still can't, I said I was going to learn how to say his name, I just didn't even try to learn. I, I didn't, I'm not even going to lie. What do you need, though? Uh, I think zone will be good. Because you are my user. You do have decent hit power. You're kind of fast, too. You kind of could. We could turn you into kind of a beast, honestly. Um, Let's stick in pass coverage, since that's your highest thing. Let's push you over to 78. Man coverage goes up, end zone coverage, pursuit, and play wreck. Those are some good things to have going up and you do have a uh ability slot unlocked because what did you do oh you had a scenario last week i almost forgot that was last week wait what did we do last week that gave him that tim jerry i thought it was timmy jerry again. guess not oh you had a face scan also guess not uh, block check go up, definitely. We're going to run stopper. That is your highest thing. Anyways, boost to 76 overall. It gives you plus one block check, plus two to tackle. Not bad at all. And Trey Caldwell, our superstar development running back. Obviously, you're going to go elusive every time because that's what you need. Please be a speed upgrade somewhere. Plus one to speed. So what's your speed on 93 now? All right, that's very good. Like, really good. I think we'll get, be better if you get your agility up. Because your speed's on 93. Acceleration on 96. If you get that agility to, like, a 91, maybe. Like, 90, 91. That will be very different. Very, very different. Also, the juke move, spin move, all those stuff need to go up. Because, like, you can't really make guys miss it in traffic. Going to get right into this game. Against the Browns, we're gonna check who they have on their team as superstar X Factor. We see Stefan Diggs on there, Kevin Byard, Buddha Baker, and Corey Littleton. I almost say Cortland Sutton. So they kind of have a really good defense. Like most of their, well, all the superstars are on defense except for uh, Stefan Diggs. So you have two safeties who have it. And a uh, linebacker, which is it's gonna be kind of a tough game, but we're up for it. I wonder who their quarterback is. I wonder who. Well, I do wonder about this whole team. Mainly the quarterback, though, because the quarterback is gonna be a big telling of how we play this game. I'm not recognizing that quarterback number nine. Could that be Matthew Stafford? I think it is. Yeah, that's definitely Matthew Stafford. Um, we have been playing like really, really good defense, like. Elite fucking defense. Jerry Goff has been playing decently also. We've been playing really elite defense as of late. Especially with this team. Well, especially against some... I don't want to say good teams, but... Very decent teams that we couldn't beat in the past. So, we are still in the hunt. We're not technically in a wild card yet. Uh, we just need a few teams to lose. Well, if we... Maybe if we beat the Browns here, we could be in the wild card. If we can kick this out to the outside, we will get there. We will get there. All right, decent. Did I change his ability? I don't remember if I changed his ability or not. He had a good week last week, two touchdowns. Roughing the quarterback? Yep. I kind of felt it, but... The throw was fucking so off that I really couldn't tell. They have Melvin Ingram also. I was gonna be a pass right here. Might even dump this down. 
Yeah, we didn't even change it, but he has a return man on. Holy shit, that's horrible. There we go. Nice speed. I already kind of see that speed paying off. It's going to be a screen. Not really a screen. It's more of like a smoke screen type deal. There's a hold. Has to be a hold. Illegal blocker? Illegal man? How? If I... I like automatically passed it though. I really wish, like, I threw that because I thought it was gonna set up a block, but it just really didn't. All right, we're gonna have to settle for a field goal right here. A pretty easy field goal, I might add. It's gonna put it three to zip. Uh, decent drive, nothing too crazy. All right, Matthew Savage is going to make his way to the field now. See what type of seasons he's having for the Browns with their 5-5 five and five record. Not bad. Just under 2,500 yards, 14 touchdowns, and 8 interceptions on the season. Wow, that's a really fucking good run. Really good run. Holy shit. Mac Wilson, not Mac Wilson, Marlon Mack, 31 yards on that run. Turn around! Like, if Wilson would have turned around, we would have had that pick. Uh, I gotta go. I could have got in. I really could have got in. Big hit, fumble. Let's go. Oh, we're gone. We're gone. Let's go. Big fucking plays. Big fucking plays. Who was that? Darnell Savage. Interesting. That was Darnell Savage. Wow. So that's going to put our lead at 10 to zip now. I'm telling you, defense makes big plays. Offense just manages the game. And that's all we need. No blockers out there. Oh, yep. I'm going to let that go because there's a... Illegal block in the back. And that's going to be coming not all the way back, but it's going to come back a decent bit. We have no match for them. Like, do you see this? Good tackle that time. All right, <laughs> good D. He threw that shit like immediately. Did not wait. Did not care what the coverage was. Like I'm throwing this to my wide receiver. There we go. Nice catch. Run. First down for. What's this dude's name? Dallas Goddard. I think I want to try to hit. Maybe Chris Godwin. Maybe. Uh, I tr it's just pressure got in and, you know, wind ups. Third and 23 now. Great. Come on. It was a good throw, though. It was a good throw. Good tackle. Oh, yes, still a good tackle, though. Still a good tackle. 
Like, he's so fucking elusive sometimes, man. Just green. Easy tackle. Matt that was just three or six, 15 yards. Uh, they just been better on the run today for some, well, not for some reason. Probably because their offensive line is good and ours isn't. Start off with the drive with a run. We're kind of in the same spot we were in last time when he punted the ball to us. We're on eight last time, we're on a 12. Try to get to that outside, really couldn't get that speed where someone wanted. It's an intel. The throw was so fucking horrible by me. That was my fault. I can't blame Jared Goff on that. It's me. I looked down for like a fucking second. Like, I swear, I looked down for one second. And I see like someone rushing in. So I'm just like, all right, I have to get rid of this ball. And the first button I press is A. Just like, I don't even know if that's instincts or what. But, gave our first uh, score of the game, puts it 7 to 10. There we go. We could have made him miss, could have been gone. That's why I just want that other ability unlock so we can get Jukebox. And when, once we get Jukebox, it's, it's kind of over, man. Like, we're being real about it. Can't really stop us with jukebox. There we go. Easy catch for Josh Gordon. Again, it's a first down. We're about just at midfield. Oh my gosh. It's not even the throws either, bro. It's me. It's me. So this is the first time we're going down in a couple weeks, I want to say. I think we've been playing very, very good football. But, you know, the mistakes are catching up to us now, especially early on in this game. Need to come out and try to have a good drive with Jared Goff. Back-to-back -back drives that have thrown interceptions. Back-to-back -back drives that has been for pick sixes. So, trying to make this a good one. Hopefully, we can. Oh, my God. I should have. The block wasn't even that good, but I should have just took the outside. All right, third and four. We're going with a screen. So, who knows how this might turn out for us. There we go. I believe this is Snell. No, that was actually Kalen Balaj. Interesting. What was he doing on the field in that set? Oh, we got the outside. There we go. That was actually Benny Snell. The guy said, the guy said, the guy who I said, I am never going to reach on. Isn't that funny? Kalen Blodge comes in, has a very decent run. Benny Snell comes in the game, has a very decent run. Trey Cole comes in the game, has a very shitty run. Like, what? How does that even add up, bro? He caught that out of bounds? What? Like, I did not want to throw that on the run, but it just happened to be on the run. Wow. He caught it, but that's crazy. He mossed his own teammate. And he just couldn't get feet. He, could, he could, couldn't get any feet down. That's what it was. He just couldn't get any feet down. Oh, my God.
god, bro. What a beautiful route and a beautiful way to hold on. And now we are in scoring threat. Now we just can't do anything stupid. Doesn't matter if we get three on this, doesn't really matter. We just need points. No, come on. Like, let me go to the outside on those. Still puts us four for five. Still a good run, but damn, I wanted to really hit the outside. I kind of want to get this run off. Falling forward for another damn near five yard gain. That was a two minute warning. <laughs> Probably get another run off here. Maybe. Let me see if I was to go to a pass and I move Dallas Goddard out. Would anybody follow him? So a safety out there does follow him. Huh. So let me block everybody, right? Chris Godwin, slant. <sighs> Damn, that's like pressure got in so fucking fast. Fourth and two, what do I do here? I think I just have to take my points. I have to take my points. Like, it, it, the pass is wide open, but Jared Goff just... If he's under pressure, he's not hitting the throw. Like, at all. All right, so it puts the lead... Well, not the lead. It puts the score 13 to 14. They're going to have uh, some time to drive downfield here. I mean, our defense has played well when they had the ball, so... They have never scored when they had the ball, so I'm confident in that my team gets stopped. Come on, that fucking linebacker has to make a play. What's not a linebacker? That's a fucking safety. Jared Wilson, you have coverage. Bruh, we have to play better on him. Big hit, no fumble. They call their timeout, which is awesome. Yo, they purposely made him throw that horribly. Like, if you looked... Oh, my God. If you look how the ball went. Can we please get a stop? Oh, my gosh. My safety just didn't fucking play it. And I covered the running back because... Duh. I mean, we're only down by, what, a touchdown now? Well, technically eight. See? I said I need all the blockers. I get all the blockers. They block good for a little bit, and then... They said, what if I just don't block no more? And I said, why would you do that? They said, because I hate you. Did he really catch that? No. So, we're actually not going to get any points right here. Isn't that fucking delightful? I mean, if we cause a hit stick, maybe. They actually scored. There's no fucking way they actually scored. They actually scored off of this. You're a victim. We are so shit. Oh my god. So going into the half, we think it's going to be 13-21. Let's have a good defensive drive the next time we come out on field. No, they said fuck that. Let's give up a touchdown and let's be down by multiple scores. Even more scores than we already are. Oh my god, is this a shit show right now?
Big hit, no fumble. Fuck. Big hit again, no fumble. Marlon Mack has my wrist on 24 yards. That's great. Good fucking sack. Oh, very good sack. All right. Let's not give anything right here, fellas. Like, why did my game has a, have a freeze, like, in the middle? Like, it lag spiked. What the fuck was that about? All right, fourth and nine. Are they going... They are going to actually uh, attempt a field goal. Probably a pretty easy field goal. It's probably going to put it 30 to 13. Well, 31 to 13, actually. Kick is up, kick is good. It was almost off, but... Drifted a little bit more to the left than it is at right. It's 31 to 13. Need a score right here. If we don't score right here, I think the game is kind of over. I don't know what the fuck I'm throwing it to. Everything is boxed. All right, something might be open here, right? Gonna hit him with a post underneath route. There we go, good fucking catch. Good way to hold on. Keep that drive alive. Might need to run a little bit on this. There we go. First down. Come on, good drives. Definitely need a touchdown here. I don't think you go for field goals. It's single high safety, so I think my best bet is to go deep. That's just what I think. I just put a couple deep routes on the field. They all look covered, so, you know, just go underneath. A lot of things in this game just is depend on how much time you have to throw. There we go. Nice run. I would love to throw a play action on this. I would really love to throw a play action. I think I'm going to try it. Nothing is open. I'm just going to use my legs. All right. Use our legs. Get out of bounds. Get about eight yards on that one. Hit him with a run. Coach Jericho is probably shit tired right now. There we go. Nice. Might hit him with a few more runs. Play action right here. Nobody really falls for it. But we end up catching it and let's fucking go. <sighs> right. 19 to 31 right now. It's going to be 20 to 31. We come out have a... A good defensive drive, and we come on offense, come have another drive on like this, we're back in the game. I can feel it. It's like, bro, come on. We need, like, I don't know what the fuck we need on that. Because everything is covered except that, like. Good shit, because I didn't know what the fuck type of play that was. I thought it was a run. I was just like an RPO type ordeal. Here I go with the fucking ordeals again. I 
I'm stuck. Good. Very good. All right. It's almost like they're shooting themselves in the foot a little bit right now. It's third and 19. And it has no business being third and 19, kind of. Thank you. Jared Wilson with a sack. All right. Now they're way out of field goal range. Like, they were at midfield at one point. Nothing should get in. We're block. We're blocking. There we go. I could have waited a little bit longer, but I was not risking a, a, a bad throw. I could not have a bad throw on that one. All right. It's going to be third and four right here. That guy is fast, but we still get the first down. Entering the fourth quarter now, down by 11. Come on, y'all. Good shit, good shit. The way I saw the defender play, he could have made a jump on it. He really could have. There we go. All right. Go off for the run right here. There we go. Almost in. We fumbled, but... Oh, man. Did we really fumble that? Did we really... I think I was down. I was down. Oh, thank you. I was about to say, like, what are the fucking chances of that really happening? Can we really get this? Falling in. Let's go. All right. Big clutch drives. Big clutch drives. They want me to go for it. I don't know if I can do this. I didn't know I was going for it, honestly. Can I put him on a whip? I can. I'm trying to call it a whip. Sort of sick. There we go. Beautiful. Always works. You got good route running, route tech. That route is always going to work for you. Now we're only down by three with a lot of time in the game. So even if we give up a field goal, preferably a field goal and not a touchdown, we are still in the game. Good tackle. Let's go. Third and ten. Let's go. Whew. Right there. Good first. Might look for a screen here. Screens have been working pretty well for us today. Yeah, that time it just could not get the screen to work. Oh my god, I had it. I had it. I had it. Third and 26 is now what we needed. It's going to call for a big-ass conversion right here, dude. 
I gotta call time out. Oh man, I just I fucked up. This time I could come to hurt us. It's gonna come to hurt us. Yep, this time I was gonna really come to hurt us. I can feel it. Oh man, we just we blew that. We could have just took a delayed game and tried something. I don't know. But this is bad. There we go. Jeffrey. That's a good way to start off a drive or defensive drive. Good tackle. Because, my God, like, he had so much space to run. I don't get how we're one of the best rush defenses in the league and we're, we give up so many yards. Like, that should just not make any sense to me. You got to get on this one. Big hit, no fumble. <sighs> They're there. Like I said, we can't give a touchdown. Give up three, but not a touchdown. There we go. He almost like punched him in the face on that one. He dropped it? Yes, yes. Good. Clock stops and it's third down. There we go. Jeffrey Simmons again. So we actually take him out of field goal range, which is fucking huge. There we go. We did get out of bounds too, so. <sighs> Two minute warning is not there yet, but no, we're right there. Oh my god, it's just fucking overthrown. We lost. That's it. Game's over. I mean, technically no, but yeah, game's kind of over. They're going to give us a two-minute warning. That's basically a timeout right there. I don't want to call timeout right here. The ball carrier. He's tackled at the 32 yard line. A gain of four brings up third and four. You need a stop. Game over. Game over. I mean, we tried, man. We tried uh, a couple mistakes, just a couple mistakes down the stretch. And that's all it was, just mistakes. Um, I think it came down to, I think our defense played well, especially down the stretch. Uh, not really allowing another touchdown after they got that touchdown in the first half. It came down to our offense not being able to score. The mistakes, uh, not being able to convert. Yeah, it was just... Not a good game for Jared Goff, honestly. Both quarterbacks didn't play particularly well. Obviously, Matt Stafford had a better completion. But in terms of yardage, touchdowns, and whatnot, just not a really good game. Jared Goff threw three intos. 
It's just like he's very inaccurate, man. It's like you have to have a clean pocket frame to throw in at all times. It's just very crazy. Can't complete throws. Um, not even gonna say we got away from the run because we still tried to run the ball a little bit. We still got it here and there, but like I said, that, like down the stretch, this wasn't wasn't very effective. But um, with them running the ball, very effective. Even us, we was kind of effective. 18 rushes, 98 yards. 17 rushes for Marlon Mack with 146 yards. He was 8.5 on the ground. He's very hard to stop on the ground. Like I said, I feel like their offensive line was very, very elite. And even with them receiving, they had a big game. Well, I say big game because... All of Stephon Diggs catches were huge yardage situations. Not huge yardage, but a big yard situation when they needed it to, for, especially to convert uh, third downs. Um, just get downfield sometimes. I mean, even though he had, had three catches, sixty-three yards, just big. Um, for us, not really. Trey Cole had the most catches because he was on those screens. Five catches for 50, 45 yards. C. Lamb had a touchdown and did three catches, 44 yards. Gordon, same thing. And uh, Chris Godwin only had one catch, 18 yards. You know, it is what it is. Can't, uh, couldn't went down the stretch, so. Hey, what can you do? We're going to move on to five and six now. Uh, probably not eliminated from the players, but it's probably a safe bet to say that we're, might, we might not get in the playoffs with this, uh, with this loss here. And we were facing the seven and four Panthers. Uh, we do get to see the playoff picture now. We're obviously not going to be in it. But, um, like I said, with, a, with that win last week, we could have possibly gotten it, but just the way the, kind of the standards are going, we're, Probably not. So you see the teams in our division, like the the Jets and the Dolphins are in it. Well, we obviously know the Jets are going to be in it because they have a good record. But the Dolphins, let's see what their record is. They're six and five. So like I said, we would have won. We definitely would have been in the playoffs. But now with a loss, we really don't know what our playoff future is and looking like. Um, yeah. If you enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you are new, and I'll see you in the next video. But until next video, peace.